The Wehrmacht found out that Pervitin reduces fear, uh, it reduces your need to sleep, and it makes you uh, more aggressive. So these three reasons seem perfect for the German army in 1940. I'm Norman Ola, I wrote a book called Blitzed. It's uh, an account about the drug abuse in Nazi Germany. Pervitin was invented by a Berlin company called Temmler in 37. Um, it was a totally new medicine on the market, uh, a cure-all, and um, it contained pure methamphetamine. Today we call it we call methamphetamine crystal meth, but it's, today it's produced under uh, different um, conditions in illegal labs. So methamphetamine by Temmler was, was a pure product. Pervitin was taken orally, so the effect is milder than um, snorting crystal meth. Drugs came into play, for example, for the army um, in the war as a sort of pharmacological weapon just as they used uh, real weapons to fight. The Wehrmacht found out that Pervitin reduces fear, uh, it reduces your need to sleep, and it makes you uh, more aggressive. So these three reasons seem perfect for the German army in 1940. Churchill said to his French colleague um, Daladier when the Germans attacked that uh, he shouldn't worry so much about the speed of the German army because after 12 hours um, they would have to rest. But uh, the German army being high on methamphetamine didn't have to, to rest. Churchill didn't know about this. So in the first uh, three days and three nights the Germans made uh, huge advances by just not stopping and surprising the Western allies this way.